Yo, I'm Kru34. I'm still the most erotic Kru man with the most leggy webcam on the internet. And welcome to another video on my channel. What are we go going to do today? Well, YouTube King K. Rule montages are a thing for itself. I dare saying that at this point I am definitely one of the better King K. Rule clippers on this platform. And sometimes I just look at King K. Rule montages because I'm bored and usually I can't say I'm disappointed because I'm expecting it at this point. Today we are going to look at the newest King K. Rule montages. Going up from the very top with one exception because I've already seen this one so we are starting with this one. And the video ends once I like a montage. I hope I don't have to say that this is a joke video. If you are included in this video as a montage creator. Don't take anything serious I'm saying here. I'm just kind of shitting around today because I want to. Also, we are going to skip montages from a few creators that I just kind of know too much to have anything funny happen watching their montages, which will be Mr. CEO or Mr. CEO. Patchy Dog and Bones are the ones I know from my head. And if we come down far enough, also Chrysler's. And obviously if we get to that point myself. So yeah. We are just gonna look at some of those. The quality isn't too great, I know. But I had enough struggle even setting up anything for some reason. My hardware just dies whenever I try to record myself reacting to any YouTube video, so yeah, that's really the one thing I cannot even use OBS for, I have to use my old program that I da don't use since I use OBS anymore, but well, obviously anybody that's included as a creator in this video will be linked in the description if for some reason you don't see the people linked down there immediately tell me i'm very stupid it may happen if i forget i will do so immediately if you tell me so we are starting off with has buns and his King K. Rule montage. What are the aspects I'm gonna look at to decide if I like a montage? Obviously clips. Is it over edited which happens quite often? I don't like hella Mimi montages. That's something that many people may find controversial but montages like Zava Rudo nope stay away from me with that. I cannot watch that I'll be honest. So that's definitely a big down for me. Um, not being edited at all also isn't too great. Uh, yeah, obviously the clips and the musical choice. Every time I hear Gangplank Galleon, I'm immediately going to take off a lot of points. Because God, be creative. Oh yeah, and also the montage title. Which I cannot give too much credit for, but as I said, I know this montage already. This will not be the last one we are watching this video. So let's go on. This is the start of the montage. We've got a down air spike. Then, we've got a down air spike. For the next clip. We talking about a few other factors first. No Gangplank Galleon, but in my opinion still not a, t a music that's too great for montages. Because it's a little maybe slow, not really. I don't know, it doesn't, it isn't awful or anything. It's definitely better than putting Gangplank Galleon because you had somewhat uh, of creativity here. It's not a perfect musical choice in my eyes though. So, what else is there to see already? 
it's pretty much not edited. The editing is really putting clip after another with not even any kind of transition. The clips at this point are down air, down air, down air and down air. Now we are at a down air. This time we even get a back air that doesn't kill. So you may be able to see why this is not gonna be the montage to end this video. Here the grab was kinda nice but he just missed afterwards. So yeah, at this point it's just kind of... That was the cleanest thing yet, but yeah. It's just down airs usually. And don't worry, we will start trash talking way more later. This was the biggest combo we've seen so far. The problem is that I know what's coming soon. This could have been the best clip if he finished it. This was a downer and now, now, please. Like, I watched this video before as I told. I kind of just want to know what exactly the clip is here. That's the clip. I, I'm gonna repeat it, like, that clip alone would make sure that a montage is not the one to end this video. I'm seeing forward tilt. And yeah, we are getting another down air. So yeah, that was the first montage. Well, unsurprisingly. I knew this one already and showed it because of that. I'm trying to be also kind of constructive, even though I don't think I will be able to put that up for <laughs> long. I know myself too well. So yeah, definitely try to be a little more creative with your clips. Most of them were just down air. Also, if you are not able to finish a clip, you are not able to kill your opponent, it's probably not too great of a clip. So, up to the actual newest montage. Just a little disclaimer, those black borders are not my fault. Those are part of the montage. We are also, if we somehow manage to get which is possible, if on the list we get to multiple montages of the same creator, we are not gonna watch any more of them. Which is possible because of King K. Rule Montage 23 by, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce his name. Published, I believe, yesterday. Not 100% sure. Like, if you see this video, it's gonna be something completely different anyways. So, we are starting off with... I gotta turn the music a little louder at first and quickly make sure, okay, nothing is claimed here. Okay. After the first clip, there are two things I can already say. The clip itself is fine enough. I do that myself. That reverse crown into cannonball combo is fine enough. I don't have a problem with that. But we had 18 seconds of build up, which I don't like too much. And I am... Like, the music is not Gangplank Galleon. That already gives it points. But I kind of don't know what to do with that music. Also, um, that wasn't a clip and we are yet to see a 1v1 clip as well. Um, yeah, I can already see. Once again, we don't have editing except for just cutting to clips. And... 
Yeah, that was taking very long. We are really having a lot of non-clips in between the actual clips. So, now we are seeing a 2v1 combo, I imagine. Not quite. It was mostly the Carol and probably the best clip yet. Yeah, fine enough. Uh, 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 uh. Hello? <laughs> I want to look at that name and then at the screen again. I definitely uh, have to take points off for that. Like, I, if somebody wants to say something. I don't call my monthly montages K rule montage. I have clips of other characters in between. But I just call them K rule 34's montage of the month. He got saved by Rush, which is funny enough. Ah, we. Oh! Mm. For a moment I thought that could be very cool if the Steve got countered into the cannonball, but the immediate cut, as I said already, with no editing pretty much at all. Alright. Yeah, that was a down tilt kill. That was a stupid double hit. And that is why I don't play Bowser Jr. Let's, let, let, for, for one second, let us go back. First, like, I was still at this one because that's funny as hell, but also sad. We have Carol at 177, Ness at 22%. A comeback here would be insane. He gets the back air and... Look at who died! You posted a clip of you back airing someone and dying for it. Another clip against Ness. Alright, I like the start, but that was kind of missing the combo, which is... <laughs> yeah, I can appreciate that as stupid as it is. Alright, the clip starts with you getting... Destroyed. Oh, villager K real team combo sounds kind of nasty, not gonna lie. But oh my god, I hate it <laughs> with a passion. Yeah, that's missing the combo again. Um, what the hell am I witnessing? Yeah. Yeah, that's not the greatest combo starter. Something you can do. It's a 2v1 combo. Maybe. They try to get some footstool stuff. Yeah, that that's that's funny. That's nice. And that's also the montage it seems. All right. So, with this montage... Oh, a 69th floor. Funny.
What is that ending? That's the end. <laughs> okay. So, let's start off. Uh, this montage, like, I kind of have to define the video idea now. I really have to like the montage as a cool King K. Rool montage. This one definitely had its problems, but was freaking hilarious. I am not gonna lie about that. Also, what I am just seeing at the side, if we get to a montage that takes like 10 minutes, we are only going to watch like the first up to five. Like, this was hilarious at times. I definitely could enjoy the montage, but as a K rule main, it definitely had some problems. We once again had the editing, which, well, I know I'm not great at editing at all myself, but at least like transitions between the clips. Somewhat of a context for this ending, maybe, because what? Uh, also, points away for putting a Kirby clip in a, King, in a montage that's called King K. Rule montage. What else is there? Uh, the biggest tip I can give you is... Um, cut to the point. The montage seemed kind of slow-paced at points. Because there was quite some stuff happening before the actual clip. That was probably one of the greatest downsides. The music, at first I really wasn't sure what to make of it. I honestly didn't keep too much attention later on. I think it changed. Yeah, you can do that. Definitely not a bad montage. But from a K. Rool gameplay kind of perspective, I cannot let this be the video ender yet. So, in theory, there was another montage by someone called True Blue in between. Uh, but it was a co montage of King K. Rule and King DDD. So, I'm only going to go for King K. Rule montages. Now we are at Fatalities. King K. Rule is lame. What do I think about that title? That's. Minus points. If a montage is called King K. Rule is broken or King K. Rule is lame or anything around that, we are not gonna do this. Especially with that small and big letter bullshit. No. And once again, we are starting off immediately within a clip. Let's see. Mario music. Oh, Mario and Luigi, I know. And once again, I have... Okay, that was the editing. For a moment, I thought my hardware was laggy. So, immediately, we, we take 13 seconds before we get there. And yeah, I don't know about that effect. He tried to go for something very juicy there instead, a no tag meme. And once again, the clip seems to be starting kind of early. Ice Climbers players are different. And that's... I can already see... Kind of a problem with the editing for me. Because, yeah, it isn't unedited like the ones before. But, especially at parts, it's extremely unfunnily edited. And a little too many sound effects, in my opinion. I am... That was just forward air. I am definitely gonna be more harsh than most other people on this. I'm definitely gonna be more harsh on editing like this than most other people would be. But like, why the hell for example? Earlier there was a forward tilt that just had a fart sound effect. 
and the clips at this point, yeah. Wow. Some of them are SDs. Is the prob okay, we are at 140. So what's happening? Changing the music. The music is pretty nice. I like that. LeMayo. He didn't recover. If he didn't. Why are you not showing him not recovering? Because I'm very sure he can recover from that. Also, we can already see what's all... What's always kind of a downgrade on a montage for me. We are seeing a lot of clips, no matter how good on same players on same stages, which means probably in the same game, which is just kind of a, yeah, not... Let me look at that again. Okay, this time, the edit is just stupid. 4, 7, 37. Yeah, he actually died from that. This time he showed it. Which made the edit un not useful. Uh, honestly, I need to get kind of a little faster with the montages. Which is why we are going to leave it at that for Fatalities montage. The editing was more there than for the others, sometimes a little unnecessary in my opinions how it was edited. Um, the musical choice, I can get behind that, yeah. I don't have a problem with the musical choice here. Uh, what else is there to say? The title as I said, nah, I don't like that too much. Um, and yeah, the clips are just, a lot of them were just single hits. That's just, that's pretty much the biggest downside in my eyes. Also, I should probably kind of look at the thumbnails as well. I didn't do that yet. All right, next up we have uh, The King of the Crocs by Ed101 is cool. So, this one, I have looked at the mon at the thumbnails, at least for some again. The very first watched had an auto-generated thumbnail. The second one, I believe, as well. The one we just watched had uh, an interesting screenshot from the King K. Rule reveal trailer with just a white text saying pathetic. And this one has a DK cartoon scene so let's see what this is it's 420 long points for the aha uh -huh. funny i know first off that music to start off and i can already see we are 10 seconds in and have an edit like this this could be a montage that's, in my eyes, over-edited. It's not gangplank -alien. But the second most used track. Also, uh, it's not gangplank -alien. Yet. And at this point, it's really kind of... I like it, Kaji. It's kind of a montage, exactly how I describe Mimi montages often, which is why I do not really like them. Because sometimes they feel like they try to, um, like, make very mid clips at best look good by over-editing. Like this clip was a back throw. 
What the hell is this? This clip was a back throw as well. Yeah, that's kind of what I was talking about. Please tell me you're shooting a cannonball. Why don't you reflect it and do a stupid reflect forth and back? Yeah, I can explain that to you. I already have a clip where I abuse that feature on my channel or I don't know if it's public honestly but I had a clip before where I countered a nest like that because he's invincible at the beginning of his move you can lower his reach of the up be doing this though and the clip ends this time even though it was one reflect with an edit I can appreciate this time this was far enough away okay that's enough from this montage thank you very much yeah I'm just really not a guy for editing like this I have to say once again, I decided to skip another montage because it was a King K. Rule only montage, but also a King K. Rule doubles only montage. So we skipped that. For the montage before, as I already said, the clips were not great in my opinion. Obviously, everybody can have their own opinion on that. But the editing was also overdone. Now we are watching... Royal, a SSBU King K. Rule montage featuring Mew Main by Super Salt Shakers. So, the title is more creative than some others. The thumbnail also had more effort than most others. Maybe this is the montage to do it. Yeah, uh, I kind of, I really forgot that at the beginning, but Gangplank Galleon definitely takes away like a shit ton of points from the montage. Crocodile Cacophony, especially the original versions, <coughs> sorry, of both songs. If you're using great remixes, that's something else again, but the original versions, yeah overused all right no transition between the clips the first two clips also not quite what I expect okay okay this Falcon was literally doing nothing That's definitely not giving any points here. Not too special, but not too bad either. Weird up smash, but if you do something out of it, go on. Yeah, alright. The section in the middle was the problem, and that spacing, yay. Yeah, reversal like that always possible. I prefer going for the footstool, but I'm not gonna take off points for that. That once again, well. Mm -hmm. This could have been good, but I really don't like down throw F smash as a finisher because it's neither high nor should it work at 100. What are you doing, Fel? <laughs> It's going on. Alright. If he just went off for a back air immediately, that could have been a clip I respect. But this is just once again taking too long with too much in the middle for me. Oh, and that's it. Oh yeah, that montage is pretty short. Yeah, I think I told most of my thoughts during this.
I can imagine that now we go to another one that will be too edited for me. Because the thumbnail already was a mega mind meme. No mesh by Sand Portal. And the thumbnail literally was the mega mind no you know the meme. But mega mind if that's the character's name, honestly, I don't know. Um <laughs> Was green with a carol crown. I actually have that as an emote on my discord So if you want to join the discord do so in the description Also, if you like this video leave a like and subscribe to the channel And yeah, just with the bottom text no mesh Once again, down for F smash. Also, the music is really what what. Also, exactly, that's the thumbnail. Once again, I gotta look. I honestly, for safety, I'm gonna ta turn off the music because I don't know in what way this is copyrighted. Yeah, basic enough. I am not hearing any sound effects now that could take away points mm -hmm. respectable clip two framing yeah this me looks nearly exactly like another one in the second montage we watched yeah i can definitely respect some of those clips stuff like that really isn't a pr like a problem like yeah Obviously not. I can respect quite some of those, but stuff like that, not really. The editing just visually isn't too bad. I can appreciate that. I don't know if the sound effects are, though. What the hell was that editing? So, are you gonna do a hype comeback? Forward throwback air, yes. Aegis. Maybe reflect the stuff? No. The B reverse was the clip pretty much. Another dunk? Yeah, I can appreciate that. The transition maybe was a little too long though. Up air? Mm hmm. Double back air. Alright, after two minutes. The visual editing is probably the best we've seen so far. It's not too much. The music I really do not like. And the clips, some of them are not too great. But some of them are pretty much some of the best we've seen today. I'm really struggling right now, to be honest, because on one hand, this isn't like a montage I would call insane great game, greatest gameplay. On the other hand, are we gonna see a better one soon? I have to go back a little with sound. Not much sound editing going on right now. Not much sound editing going on, the only thing we've seen was a random fart sound effect and those are not funny. For the sake of content, I have to say no, we are going on. But barely, it was the best montage we've seen today, I would say. Alright, had to skip quite a few actually now, because the one was by the same guy that did the second montage we watched, the guy with the 69 that I thought was 
actually funny as hell. Um, then was Kaisers, who I already told you I wouldn't watch. And after that, we had a King K. Rool and Donkey Kong Co. montage. So next up, we already have one that has to lose points for the title. Not only is it boring, but also SSUB is written wrong. This is, as you see, nine minutes long. We are not gonna watch even close to everything. By Gabriel Wong. We are starting immediately right into the clip with Gangplank Galeon. If the clips do not really show off, this could already decide it. And I'm waiting for something to happen. I really hope everything works. Guys, I'm watching neutral. With unfunny bra sound effects. What did the Meta Knight do there? If the next clip is just again a random kill, mo okay, alright. What? What is this editing? <laughs> yeah, we are getting to the point where I'm not being too uh, neutral about it anymore. Not too constructive with my critic. Yeah. Nah. <laughs> Let's go on. Alright. We are looking at King K. Jewel Montage Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. By Bowser. Who can now make Smash videos better. I want to um, say really quickly. That's how it looks. Yellow, yellow K rule points for that. Kind of basic, but not too bad with the music. Yeah, editing like that, alright. I mean, obviously, it would work, but that sound I thought wasn't placed great. Especially since it was placed on... We have a back throw kill, okay. Like that pains me. If somebody puts themselves messing up in a montage and editing a random bra sound. Alright. But yeah, let's already stop here. The thing is. From the clips, this was one of the better ones as well, in my opinion. I may also have dropped my standards already throughout this video. It is one of the better ones, clip-wise. But like, for the 360p only, it's very hard to say I like this montage. Combined with some of the editing, sorry, but that's the next one. Now we are looking at... Shotgun, a King K. Rool montage by, I am not trying to pronounce that name. Ooh. 
at this point, we are listening to bike sounds, motorbike sounds. Mm -hmm. Also, I kind of don't know if that's copyrighted. It's at YouTube Kids, definitely. Well, for safety, I'm gonna do this. And look at the clips. Uh, what exactly was that clip before? It was Carol getting hit by uh, unsafe on hit down and punishing with down tilt F smash. All right. Yeah. What? Okay, decent spot dodge read. He lived, it seems. I'm quite sure he was he was recovering from there. He had to have been. He was at last stock before, and that clip was the same game. Even though it's once again many, many back airs. What people always say about K rule. No, okay, so I haven't told that yet because we didn't have it yet. But if there's there is one thing that makes me aggressive in Carol montages, it's people just clipping, hitting someone with a cannonball, shooting the cannonball again, and it hits the opponent again. Because, God, that's really just your opponent doing everything wrong they could be doing wrong. It's so easy to dodge those cannonballs. A lot of down throw uh, mesh read up smashes. Is this gonna be a back air reversal? It was a back air reverse. That's something that a montage shouldn't be predictable. It was just an up air. Let me guess. He's just gonna turn around, go off stage, and back air him. What was that edit? Oh, that's it! Hmm, yeah. My opinion should be clear enough. Once again, we had multiple in a row from people that I either know. Bones was in there. Cr I, Mr. CEO was in there. And there was a co-montage, so once again. Now we are looking King of the Kremlings by Combo Food. That starts right in a clip with Gangplank Galleon. Double dunk, alright. I just kind of want to know why the percentage was turned off here. Especially, I kind of... I want to look at that again. Because I play enough against different kinds of opponents. And I know that this jump air dodge is the hardest habit computers have. So this clip seems suspicious to me. I just talked about this! And he's alive and recovers at a bad angle. Also, how often do we want to see down air into... Mewtwo likes doing the wrong thing. Back air, back air, back air, let me guess. Back air spike. After a down tilt, I'm always expecting too much, I feel like. Up shot, up air, huh. Also, it's mm, once again pretty much not edited. What the heck? Alright, do something. That was yet another opponent just completely messing up their recovery. 
that seems to be a thing in this montage. Also, you missed your ledge trap. That was very well timed to not trigger the counter. You missed your combo. Also, you were pretty much just camping a Jigglypuff under the platform there. Don't suck and cuck, don't suck. Please. Suck and cuck is not a clip, thank you. Wi-Fi K rule down smashing. The montage. We already had to skip the next montage from the first guy that we looked at. Now we are looking at the Kremlin King. Not too creative. By Terrific Gaming Bros. Oh no. Like King of Skill is funny as hell, I love watching his videos. Except for his montages, because they are exactly what I said I don't like about montages. A ditto to start off. The quality isn't great though. It is 720p, but it doesn't look like it. Back air? No, he missed his down air and then punished. Easiest stock ever. You missed your punish, bro. Back air. Always I'm predicting the spikes and then they miss. Also, that first clip really was neutral. Yeah, hä? Hey, what's the problem? Did you just figure out you can spot dodge Roy side B? Also, the music, in my opinion, does not fit montages because it's very slow. Yeah, in, in my eyes, a lot of this at this moment is looking like missing dunks. Ah, uh, you're gonna reflect it back once again. That's the second time you did that. This time with a shield break though and... We are done here. Now we are moving on to King K Rule Montage 3Z by Top Help Builder 16 THB 16. Yeah! I maybe should have left after no mesh. Yellow. Is it just a back air? Please don't just hit him off stage and back air him. Honestly, let's move on. There isn't much editing and I... That music is pain to me, honestly. I don't know if people actually listen to, to that. I really, really dislike the music a lot. And with that clip just being puff hitting a rest and you punishing with a smash attack. Yeah, next one. Okay. I have hope that this could be the end. We are now looking at I'm Back, the k rule montage you weren't expecting by Marson. <sighs> Come on, I believe I've heard that name before. Let's start this off with a zero to death, shall we? Ah, uh, feels good to be back. Yeah, take some of that, Cloud. I don't know don't about that voice now. editing. That God. clip was nice. All right, Cloud, in you go. That <laughs> clip wasn't. Uh, oops. Hey, Cloud. Yeah, sorry, but once again, I'm already leaving it. 
I'm sure this would be a great montage if that voice acting was anything I could just somewhat get behind. But I really don't like using that word. But how that voice sounds and how it's used is kind of cringe to me. We skipped another one by Top Hat Builder and by um, Salt Shakers or whatever the name was. Now we are watching a very short Kale montage by Miserycon. DDD theme from Forgotten Land. Right, nice B reverse ledge trap, mm, but missing your move there. All right. I can get behind, yeah. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> okay, that was stupid. Yeah, the clips seem like something I can get behind, though. Please. Oh, oh, yeah, I like that. He went for the footstool. You may have seen my clip where I did that as well. You could have maybe gone uh, for a down tilt, but that was... Yes! It's pretty much not edited again. Nice. So it's pretty much not edited again. Oh, we're already close to the finish. Nice. So that's it for this montage. What do I have to say about it? It once again was pretty much unedited. Well, that's one thing. It was very short. I can get behind the musical choice. That one Meta Knight clip was funny. Funny is also always good in a montage. Yeah. That's it for this video, guys. We found the montage. Still shout out to everybody who also had a montage in this video. The montage No Mesh and the second one we, we watched were also nice. No Mesh had pretty nice clips. The first, uh, the second one was hilarious to watch. But Miserycon was the one to do it with clips that I actually liked. The first one at the beginning wasn't too great, but I especially, especially like that one, um, I think this one it was. Especially like the one with the footstool back air. Exactly this one. So that's it for this video. 53 minutes of content. Maybe if the feedback is uh, alright, we are doing something like that again in the future. Maybe you really don't like this kind of format though I could... I could understand if you said, no, this wasn't a good video. You just watched others' montages and were pretty rude about it. I try not to be... I know that I often am too rude as a person, sadly. So yeah, that was it for this video. If you enjoyed it still, leave a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. Visit the people whose montages we watched today. They are linked in the description, if not tell me. Bye.